Hello everyone, we should be live now with any luck. Oh god, what what's that? Oh, it's an ad. Oh, I th I'm sorry, I got a noise then in the background. I was like, what is that? And it's just an ad that's playing. It's fine, don't worry. Everything is chill when you are a gamer. It's, it's no worries. I got caught off guard by an ad and I feel silly, but it's okay. You guys couldn't hear it because I muted the, the, the uh, desktop audio before I started. Just in case an ad plays and then I get copyright problems with whoever run the ad. It's all about that, that madness. What's this? Oh, hang on, that's um well, that's all the that's all the um the Xbox social stuff that you get on bloody PC when you use a controller. Right, okay, nobody cares about any of that. But let's let the Discord know that we're live so that they can join us. Um We are live gamers and now we're now I guess it's time to to get cracking. Isn't that right? I do hope your day is going well. Well, so do I. Now, here we are, doing the gaming. What is this? That needs to... No, well, we can... Here we are. Right. How are you all doing in thine chat? All hail the King Gamer. Right, okay, blood in the water is what we're doing. Meet, reach Murty's Villa. And that's the viewpoint in the distance over in that general direction. I guess there's... I guess that is, you know, a good direction to head in. Now, I want to get Curse of the Pharaoh sort of done. Like, eventually... Like pretty quickly because I want to oh for fuck's sake this horse is useless I want to get on to do the um I want to do the what is it it's called uh yeah it's the horizon DLC the frozen wilds I want to do next I love that the horse just goes around look at that horse go it's an absolute sociopath of the craft ah here we are ah yes let's get the likes up by the way that would be fantastic PewDiePie's also like but you're a better gamer yeah, I don't really think I'm trying to contend with bloody PewDiePie, so I think I'm okay. Um, I just want to stream for the sake of streaming. Would you recommend starting a new game on AC Origins? Uh, depends on whether or not you want to. If you want to, absolutely. If you don't, then don't, I guess, is the best way to describe it. Like, it's one of them. Cigarette chair, you absolute legend, showing up and doing bits. What a stir you are. Cheers for the super chat. Gaming, gamer, game. The exact the exact words that I too would wish to share with all my gaming brethren. Now, let's get up to that viewpoint and do some bits. I want to bulldoze that flamingo, but fuck. Okay, here we are. All right. Mad horse. It's a mental horse. The absolute mental variety. This viewpoint is important. I apologise if you can hear my uh, fan in the background, but it ha it's a necessary evil at this point. I mean, it's not as hot as it was yesterday. I've even got a t-shirt on today. <laughs> so if I wanted to enable face cam, I guess I could. There's just the technical side of it that I don't want to faff with as well. Um, and also, I quite like not having my face shown sometimes. It's just it's just good. It's good to have people comment on, you know, well, talk about irrelevant things as opposed to your appearance sometimes. Like, oh, I love your beard. As much as that's great, it also comes with people who go, Hey, you look like um, Megamind did cocaine. And believe it or not, it's one of them. After Valhalla, what do you think is coming next? Uh, I don't know. I guess another Quebec game, but I don't know after Odyssey if Ubisoft will go, Yeah, let's do another Quebec game. But I presume there will be one. Oh no, considering all that's happening at Ubisoft at the moment, they, a lot of things would be up in air about that. Uh, that, okay, there's another thing that I'd, I'd do. So I think, ma who knows, maybe there, maybe there's an optimistic opportunity uh, for for Ubisoft to rejuvenate the work ethic a little bit with what's going on. Uh, furthermore, apparently Ubisoft created a Twitter account for Prince of Persia that's currently private. Um, so maybe at Ubisoft Forward, we'll see a Prince of Persia announcement finally after years without Prince of Persia. And if that happens, I'll be I'll be quite happy with that. To be fair, I've never been too into Prince of Persia, but I always loved those games. Like you know, they're good games. Some of them, some of them genuinely suck cock, but others not so much. Have you pre-hoarded Valhalla yet? No, I haven't. Not yet. I have. We haven't seen gameplay. Like as soon as we've seen gameplay, I'll see if I want to pre-order it then. But as of right now, we haven't seen any gameplay whatsoever, so that is that is it. That is important, I think, to understand. Right, as soon as we've seen gameplay, I'll be able to tell you whether or not I'm gonna 
through all of the game. And there's also the fact that I'll probably be able to blag a review copy anyway, so might not be any point in, you know, pre-ordering at all. You will not escape! But you know me, I'm a gamer. I'll do gaming. How you doing, lad? It moi. Last time I played Prince of Persia was when I played the trial on the PS2. That's pretty cool. Long time ago. Let's get the likes up and share the stream, everybody. That would be super appreciated. I don't understand why not many people have showed up to these Origin streams. Like, usually we had hundreds for like Unity and Syndicate, and now it's just like sort of dialed right back. It's really confusing. I guess, I guess, um. Being something of an RPG, it's less interesting to watch, more interesting to play. I guess that might be why. Cheers to the super chat, James Rostron. I really do appreciate it. Right, die, dickhead. Now, who next? Speak to Murty. I'd love to, but also, no. Ah, a door. You hear that? Horn that blew in the background. It's a no moment. Oh god. You? You are behind these soldiers at my door. You lied to me in tips. Don't be naive. I told you all I could. If I betrayed the others, I would be dead already. What's an odd face? The relic. You knew of its power. No. Until you came to my shop with bloody blades and a debt to be paid. A debt still owing. Your Aten. We searched for it and it eluded us. A gilded myth of order, truth, justice, painted upon the walls of a heretic's tomb. And after what happened, I stopped looking. What happened? Slaughter. Of some poor soul who tried to stop our desecration. I never knew who did not want to know, but... I profited, and for that, my heart is heavy. Then lighten it. When you came to Thebes, I started searching again, and I knew someone had found it. Did you discover who has the relic? That knowledge is shrouded, but it does not belong to men. It holds the power of the gods. And it won't be long before someone discovers how to harness that power completely. Then Amun help us all. This is where the trail led me. Bought from an antiquarian at the necropolis of the nobles. It says the relic was used in a Ma'at ritual. A ritual long forgotten. Take it. I am ready to leave this cursed land. Ah, gaming. Oh, look at this man. Hello there, it me. The claimer of hearts comes for me. I don't understand why this man showed up here, but okay. He is going to die. The relentless one. This is meant to be the introduction to these guys, but I think we're all well aware of who they are by now, it's fine. Do not worry, the Relentless One is deceased. Shadow of Anubis, more like Shadow of Being Dead. Now I suppose we could go in this general direction and explore the Waset Desert. There are some cool things like this place here. Well, no, there's an oasis area down in the Wasset Desert that's quite interesting, but we don't really need to go there yet, so... I suppose we carry on in this general direction. Fish out of water could be a good quest to, you know, detour and do first, however. I mean, time's on our side. Kill this flamingo. Oh, God. I want to kill the flamingo desperately. Where's my horse? Fangs? If you could, like, show up at all. 
That will be splendid. Oh, there you are, sir. How you doing? That's obscured. Ashraf will come back after he's dealt with his personal issues. Um, thing is, though, though what what's happened has resulted in personal issues for him. It's not necessarily a personal matter that started it. It's a very, very serious thing that's happened. Um, if you and I feel like, uh, oh no. It is, it, is hard, it is rough work, basically, is what I'm saying. I don't really want to get too into talking about it again, because we spent the last two streams discussing it pretty at length. And, uh, yeah, that is, it's, it's a lot to take in. I mean, what's happened is a lot. Like an absolute hefty lot. But it is what it is. You like gamer? A little son, a little fuss like clucking hens. How did you end up here, Neb? His name is not Neb. His name is Sir. Said I tore his nets and set the soldiers on me. They took everything I owned. The soldiers stole from you. Recompense for the injury. As if nets are worth my father's ring. The steward should do something. But I waited all day in the sun to see him. Ah, a suspicious scheme indeed. Ah, he's scheming. He's busy. Many head to the desert west of the village. More will fall foul of it. I will talk to this so-called fisherman. Yes, you will. I, will I can't wait for Ghost of Tsushima to come out. I reckon... Or, or Tsushima, sorry. Just I keep saying that wrong. I reckon I'll probably stream a playthrough of that. Ghost of Tsushima. And it'll be... And it'll be good. I reckon, anyhow. I think it'll be the... The wise thing for me to do. Um... I hope so, anyway. Doubt Ash can ever go back. But we'll find out, won't we? They're currently investigating all the allegations and things against all people um, who have been accused um, at the moment, Ubisoft. So I guess we'll have to wait and see, find out what they actually, what action they're actually going to take. But until then, it's just best that we don't necessarily speculate because it could be... I don't know. It could, it, it could just no, wind up being a bit of a madness. Nets. You have ruined my livelihood. Will no one give me justice? Who are these guys? Pay for the damage, Neb, or face the cells. Play to the fisherman. Please, it is not what you think. Please. Hagil. I think that you and the soldiers are working together, extorting travelers on the road. Ah, so it is what you think. But I am as much a victim as the merchants. Doubtful. How so? A ratty little thief like you. Ratty? No, the steward is to blame. He holds my family captive, threatened to kill them if I did not go along with his scheme. Your family? My cat, Lord Furface, is all the family I have. He has a cat called Lord Most Furface. Us, those that that's, not, they got you know what, that's actually pretty odyssey, isn't it? Lord Furface, the cat in Assassin's Creed. <laughs> Convince, and the steward uh, takes all. I do not want to see you here again. It is... No. No, you will not. A man can always get a new cat. The merchant puts his head in the lion's mouth. I must find him first. Don't forget to leave a like on the stream, show to your friends, hit subscribe if you're new, and remember, um, Lord Furface, he's a twat. Let's abscond. Legend Lord, the legendary Lord Furface. Lord Furface is my favourite obscure Assassin's Creed character. Go sleep and do oh for fuck's sake, man! Hold on. Fucking wall getting in my way and hindering my schemes. We hate it. Bloody walls, man! Oh god, stabby man! Fuck it, you're gonna die now. Trying to warn the merchant. I love warning merchants. It's my favourite thing to do in the day. What's your favourite thing to do in the day, Fishy? Well, sometimes I like to warn merchants that Lord Furface is coming for them. Oh no, this merchant does not appear to be in the best of health. He was no threat. 
This, this is your doing, meddler. This man is dead because you meddled in affairs that do not concern you. I will face you at the shipyard if you have the balls to try and come for me. Steward Historicus. Surely to Christ, don't tell Bayek who you are. This man was murdered as a warning to me. Assassinate the corrupt steward. He just told us who he was. What an idiot. Maybe at the shipyard, you're wuss. Hey. I mean, I mean, he, it, props to him for not knowing that Bayek is um more or less a serial killer. But also, is about to end. maybe just. Maybe just don't be a goon, logically speak. Don't go behind that. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it, gamer. Laid to rest. Ah, fuck. Well, I presume he's in the do up, right? Oh no, it's an Aru. I guess we can go to Aru and do some bits. There are some bits left to do in Aru, so it's... Yeah, but we need to... Okay, now we can do it. Now we can go to Aru. Don't worry, gamers. I'm... I'm gaming. It's fine. What do you mean fast travel's not available? Absolutely cease this tomfuckery right now. Now I can go to Aru. Stop stopping me from going to Aru. I want to go to the, the afterlife so I can visit my cat. You're fucking joking is what you're doing right now. Oh, for fuck's sake. You will suffer for that. Goon. You know, I don't give a fuck about the Pharaoh's shadow. Now, to Aru. Finally. Can Lila's animus relive by its ancestors just like Desmond's ancestor by Eb Edward in black uh, I guess I I mean yeah I presume so At least you'd hope so See Layla's animus is really weird Like, it allows for bits and pieces, but to the point where it's not necessarily accurate to anything. Whoa. Ah, it's you. Do not worry, gamer of Aru. It is me. Do I know you. I'm sure you have the same skin as that I guy from As if the knots of our lives are intertwined. I was once a merchant. And you died at the hand of a rabid dog steward. I avenged you and have your father's ring. How can one living traverse this? Oh, is this the guy who was dead? Oh. oh. This means so much. I thank you, Avenger. Oh, I've got I've got an ability point to invest. Let's invest it in some I've got a couple of ability points to invest. There we go. A couple in Hunter. Can't go far wrong with that.
Look at how nice and dramatic it looks. Oh my god. Tell you what. We've done it guys, we've created beauty. We have created... We can tint it green. That looks nice. Don't want to oversaturate it, you want the sky to be quite light still. Layla's animus is so odd. It just is odd. But look at how beautiful that is. Oh, man. Which DLC contains Aru, Curse of the Pharaohs? You right there, sir? Enjoying being dead in that? Are you married, Sen? Once, but no longer. I am sorry. I do not mean to open old wounds. My wife would chide me for prying. If she was here. But she is not, for she is she dead. Passed through the wall of two truths. I am sure of it. Then why hasn't she joined me? Even the damned Ren ritual did not work. You spoke her true name. Should I accept that I will never see her again? Thy souls rejoined, without diminution and without defect, unto Rai Turner. It is promised. Perhaps the annals of the gate, it records all who enter. But it is a forbidden codex heavily guarded in the Lodge of Names. If your wife is here, I will reunite you. Take this remembrance. She will know it. An eternity of blessings on you, brother. Oh, now that is gaming. Right. Bread, the incense, I gathered it all, but the ritual did not work. Nice of skinned. I love Aru. It's very nice and relaxing, isn't it? Whoa. Will there be changes in Assassin's Creed Valhalla after Ashraf is gone? The only thing that will likely take a different path now is the marketing. Valhalla, for the most part, is done. Like, otherwise they wouldn't be marketing it. They wouldn't have it in a state where they'd be able to show off trailers and things. Were it not in a state where they, if they released it tomorrow, it would be it would be passable. It wouldn't necessarily be the most polished ever, but it'd be passable. And they're going to iron out those things. Do you think the animus in the East were dumb like I do, or do you like them? I, uh... I think the Animus is cool. I think the Isu were kind of a lot not in more, a lot more interesting when they were simply the ones who came before. Like they were a mystery, they were curious. Like they weren't the Isu, they were just the ones who came before. And they had this um, mysterious, eerie vibe to them whenever they were, whenever they were relevant. And you, we, could, we could get snippets of them, but we didn't get like hours upon hours of just first civilization shenanigans and I preferred that Keep our time that better work of course it doesn't work but that's fine don't even worry about it like you know? A double assassination would be useful my guys exploring <laughs> he laid down and let me kill him. Ah, oh, that's peak. Beautiful. Imagine killing a dead person. Love it. Who says it's impossible? Okay. I'm going to kill you both. Your mum is dead. Okay. Da -da -ba -ba -da -ba. I like how the boat has stopped. Oh, 
I love how even in the afterlife, Senu is actively doing bits of my enemies. Senu is immortal. Barton Car, that's not the gamer. I'm gonna have to do some gaming. A love poem. Ah, <laughs> shite to that. Here we are, gamers. Her name changed to Yenepo when she entered the afterlife. Would Anubis have decreed this? How does one change their name Could after they're dead? Heads ritual with her true name. Spoke of bread and incense. I will go game and collect incense and bread. Don't worry. Especially logic says it's impossible to kill a dead person. Spoken like somebody who's never tried. Trust me. There, you couldn't kill a dead person. You wanna know how? You enter the afterlife and you fuck them up. And they they stop, they cease existing altogether. No, once they're dead, they're pretty dead, but you know. To be fair, if they're brain dead and you switch off life support, that counts, right? That might have been a bit dark, but you get my point. Where does one find incense and bread? Why do I keep throwing down smoke bombs and that? I'm not in here rummaging the stores. Don't worry. They call me Ransack Gamer here. Right, where does one find incense? Ah. Oh. How to prepare your majesty, whatever. Your Majesty's bread. Ingredients for bread. I love the ingredients of bread. Oh, gold over there. I see where I must go, and I go where I must see. Here we are, incense. I what a quest item. Fishy, has Raid Shadow Legends ever messaged you? I took a sponsorship from Raid once. They did offer to do another one, but they, um... They didn't offer really enough. I mean... Not in that sense, I mean for the... For the response it gets, people go, Nah, I don't like you now, because you took a sponsorship. And for me, the sponsorship's got to be worth it now. Like... This Ridge Wallet sponsorship is quite a good one, I think. I was quite, I was quite pleased with it. Very happy with that one. I thought, you know what? Not wrong with the sponsorship of like genuine stuff, and I and Raid Shadow Legends isn't like um a not genuine thing. It's just the second time they come around, it's like it's a lot of effort, and oh god, sometimes you just got to get the video up. To be fair, it's one of the path of least resistance um sort of sponsorships I ever took. Because sometimes I'm like, can you change this? Can you change that? 
they'd be like, well, the video tape, that'll take me a solid hour each time to do. Just tell me all the, the edits at once. But no, I'm quite good at sifting through sponsorships these days and making sure I get the good ones um, through. And I, there are a lot that I, I take that I just don't go for. But that wasn't really the question. Do they message me like personally? Be like, hey, what's up? How you doing? And all that. No. Um, I think I must go and I go where I must see. Why is my gamer? What kind of dog do you have? Uh, Dennis is a Bernese Mountain Dog, which is the kind of dog that you would find chilling on um, chilling on snowy snowy hills and that in uh, in Switzerland. Imitating bears to keep away, um, to keep wildlife, aw to keep wildlife away from livestock and stuff like that. It draws me off, Dave. Follow the wren, I'd love to, but also my bum hurts. Ah. Stop it, Dick. You cock-faced bella. Don't worry, Ren, I'm following, slowly but surely. This thing is retrieving the urine a little bit. Look at that man sprinting rapidly through the reeds. Can you new game plus a boost save? Do you know? Like an animus, um, like, like, a, like a hacked animus save on PC. Is that what you mean? Like the animus control panel? I don't know. Fishy, did you hear about Ashraf? Yes, I did. I was very disappointed to hear what I heard. And Ashraf sort of confirmed it on his Twitter, like, but by stepping down, by apologising to all those hurt, etc, etc. And I mean, cool. Tis a, tis a bit of a sub ones, but whatever. Assassin's Creed will be fine. No, the, the, the fate of the franchise doesn't ride on any one individual. It, you know, Assassin's Creed will be fine by comparison to, uh, well, when you think about how it already is, I mean, it's not what I consider to be in the the best such like position as is. But it don't want to avenge that man. This what I'm trying to say is there's plenty of chance for Assassin's Creed to sort itself out, the same as it was before. Vi I'm still excited for Vi Valhalla. I feel like now that it's uh, controversy free, it can only it can only be better. Like, can you imagine having that sort of like when you go to work? There's that there's that stigma and that work uh, work ethic. Led into the servant of Anubis. Like I now, release it. now without that, it can be rejuvenated. Is what I'm trying to say. Watch your Red Dead 2 video on the money scam. It was great. What's the next one going to be on? I don't know yet. Um. There's plenty of stuff. The Soothsayer is one that you have like 15 encounters and I want to do all then. Uh, but that'll take some time to do. Oh no. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was a little bit comical. What the horrible shame. Okay, now I want to know what this is over here. Love all duty is complete. But I, do, I am genuinely a bit curious as to what this does. Right, boys, hit me. Ah, oh, it's below me. I mean, of course it is, right? But no, I do look forward to um, playing some good old Assassin's Creed of Valhalla at some point um, when the game launches. We don't have a release date yet. That is, that is, like, that's unusual for Assassin's Creed. What, like, oh god, 
I want to see some gameplay first, like, you know. Do you reckon they'll give us a release date of Ubisoft Forward, or do you reckon what's going on is going to hinder when they want to release the game? That's a good discussion. Do you reckon that it might wind up being delayed now until two, like sometime in 2021 or something like that? I hope not, because I'd like to... I look forward to good old Assassin's Creed, and I, know, I think they know that it'll sell, so... It's just, just a waiting game, I guess. Not of AC turning more into an RPG, and I kind of skipped it. I think it's sort of coming out of that a little bit now as well. Like it, it like Odyssey was the furthest it will go. I think uh, Valhalla, from what we've heard, is going to dial it back ever so slightly. I heard December. Well, it says holiday 2020, so that implies November, December time. Yeah. Whenever it launches, it'll be fine. Like you know, like, I can wait. No worries. I'd just like to know when, you know. Because obviously on this channel, Assassin's Creed launching is a big event. And we do bits. Jesus, we're already more than halfway through 2020. When did that happen? Oh, shit. It's my birthday next month. On the same day as Ubisoft Forward, actually. That is that is the, that is the day of my birthing, so I'll be sat there with a, with a with a birthday hat on. Probably, probably alone with copious amounts of alcohol. And God knows you'll love it. Have you played Dark Souls or Bloodborne? I have played a little bit of Dark Souls and I've played a little bit of Bloodborne and I've played a little bit of Sekiro. And I can say that the games really don't... Yeah, no, I... I'm not very good at very, very hard games, so I struggled. I've got a mate who's absolutely who's absolutely all over Dark Souls, Sekiro, and Bloodborne, um, and he's a pretty sound gamer. Will we get a birthday stream? I don't know. I mean, what do you expect me to? I don't know what I'd do. I'd be like, eh, it's my birthday. That'll be it. That that'll be what it'll be. Um, Stay away, children of Sobek. Return to the chaos waters. I oh, know it's you. So forward that day. What are you doing up here, lad? Are you uh? Anything important, I guess? You climbed all the way up here. I will grant at his poor servant's strength. How else could I escape the Raja's sons? But it is all for nothing. I deserted my friend. Oh, no. Another priest of the Lord of Truth. I will get rid of them. Then you can tell me your story. Yes, try and shoo them off. The Lord of Strife will not be happy if you shed sacred blood. Shoo a crocodile. Yeah, wait here. Idle hands. Rescue rescue the priest. He is scared of crocodiles nearby. Oh for fuck's sake, Bayek! There was a, there was a haystack right there and you chose to miss. Right in the bum crack. Speak with the priest. This game runs beautifully. PC specs. Ridiculous. Come down. I don't think... For fuck's sake, game, what do you mean? This random priest just did a leap of faith. You alright, lad? Did you see me jump? And the haystack? Amun must have spirited it there to break my fall. Clearly. Mm. So, 
What are priests of a moon doing this far from Thebes? Seni, I do not mean to frighten you, but the dead pharaohs, they walk. So I have heard. Onos and I were to perform a sacred ritual for a moon, reclaim these lands from the curse. Ah. But we were attacked by bandits on the road. I am ashamed to say I fled and did not look back. You left him? Do you think they killed Onos? Amun's plumes, they killed Onos! Peace, priest. I will look for him. We were on our way to the top of the mountain. I will make my way there. Amun's grace, he lives. Stay strong, Onos. Why would bandits risk Amun's wrath? Find and help Onos the priest. That's fantastic. Don't forget to leave a like on the stream and save for 100 likes. That would be a great number to hit, I think. Mine is Fushi's birthday, the 12th of July. It's when I was born. How do you feel about The Last of Us 2? I've been working on my review of the game over the past couple of days. Um, it's a bit of a... It's going to be very laid back. Um, especially by comparison to some of my other reviews. Because I just... I don't think I can approach this with like any form of like, like forthrightness because it's just so. You will not turn me from my path. Thought provoking. It's quite mad. By Amun, you know me. Are you real or a mirage? I am a man, a gamer man. Are we in the desert? No. Your friend Saab sent me to aid you. Come, I will bring. Saab would make a good hidden one. I cannot leave Amun's statue in their unwashed hands. I have a plan to rescue it. I just need the fresh carcass of a rabbit, some rope, a bandit's garb, a bladder of wine, and... I will find the statue. Join Saab at the ritual site. You are sure? But Thoth has granted me great insight on... Go! Weird, I've seen no mods in the chat, and I'm like dumb. Yeah, no, there's no mods in the chat, but the chat's doing quite quietly today. So it, 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 it's okay. But cheers to the super chat, cigarette chair. Bam! Right in his, right in his bloody chest. There you go. Bam! The chat is chill. Someone comes in and spams as I say the chat's being chill today. Of course they do. Like if you want me to summon the moderators, I'm sure I could get one here. But one will show up later. I'm sure either Jay, Marcus, or um, Hamid will show up at some point if if they see the stream. I mean, they might be busy, and that's fine. Sometimes the mods are just busy. I do find it a little bit odd how sometimes there are no mods that show, but considering how many mods I have. But whatever. No, it's nobody's it's nobody's life mission to moderate my streams. Moderators are just viewers too. They just have to. They just have the um, unfortunate position of having to moderate the gamers. But it's, it's whatever. Done. As long as the chat stays chill, I don't think I don't think it matters. You know, it's fine. I'm sure it'll take place on top of the mountain. Oh, that is poo. Right, let's go. Let's hope it stays chill. Yeah, with any luck. I like a good chill stream. It's good. I'm just used to having JMC or Hamid here. Yeah, or uh, or Marcus. Marcus shows up every now and then. God knows. Maybe maybe we'll see them later on. You know, it doesn't matter. Oh, what's that? Ooh. Ah, it's that. No, fuck that. Well, we're going in this general direction then, aren't we? How to jump from roofs and sit on benches. Your training is half done. Yeah, that's not too far off, is it? I'm used to be seeing both Jay and Hamid. Well, people get busy. And that's fine. Chris as well. Yeah, Chris as well. Sorry, I forget about some. Some of the moderators I have, it's just hard to remember which ones show. Hopefully Ubisoft can redeem themselves so they can be seen as a respected company again, with any luck. 
I wouldn't mind Ubisoft redeeming themselves. Rejuvenating the uh, the work ethic by uh, rooting out all those um, those clear bad seeds would be a great start. Um, and then delivering some fantastic games that actually stand for what Ubisoft wants them to stand for, which is inclusivity in the industry, would be a fantastic continuation. So, with any luck, we'll be seeing a rejuvenated Ubisoft after all this is through. And I think that'll be a good thing. They're doing good with Siege. I guess, I guess they are. But I've never really done too much for Siege. Opinions on Valhalla? Vikings and that, innit? Like, that's all there is to say. I really liked Unity. I guess, I guess that's fair enough. If you liked Unity, then that's really cool. I'm glad you did. Ah, it's one of these places where you can sit and do fuck all. Find a place to rest. In destruction, perhaps a mountain goat, or the lady of slaughter is angry. Isak, I, I, I am arrived. Great Isak, you gamer. Returns. Cheers for the super chat. Have the statue. I do. And you have more problems with animals. Sechmet's offspring will sharpen their claws on our bones. Simply a pride of hungry lions. But I have a plan. All I need is some twine, a bushel of hay. A shovel to dig a hole and stay here and keep quiet. And some dead animals. Don't worry, I've got a thing where if I see nature it dies. Lazy old lion does gaming. Defeat the children of Sekhmet. It's done. Where do I sit? Kill the lions. You truly fight with the wrath of Ra. We must start the ritual. Don't worry, gamers. I found the gaming spot. Now we've got two. We've got two ability points. Let's put one in hunter and another in warrior. Why not? Let's go with condition damage. 117 warrior points is a heavy number. My prayers spoken in Karnak went unanswered, therefore I have come to ask for your blessing. Oh, my animals are dead or dying, my crops Lord have dried and withered to die. Okay, just, just do what you gotta do, heaven, guys. Father of all things. Deliverer of those who suffer, you hear their cries and come at their behest. Lord of wisdom, Lord of mercy, opener of every eye, thou whose name is hidden. Your people are struck down, terrorized. Help us cleanse this land and protect your sapiens. Keep them safe in your shining radiance. I think this quest is done. Hail to thee, Amun Ra, Lord of the thrones of the earth. Now we need to head in this general direction to continue with blood in the water. I like the Senu skin. Same, it's a good skin for Senu. It's like, oh, it's lovely old. Lovely old Senu. Does bits. I think Ubisoft will start doing character sequels again soon. Uh, I don't know. I don't think so. I think Ubisoft wants to prioritise on doing different historical locations at this point, which is a massive shame, but also, God knows. I can see the other side of that as well, a bit of variety in the games, but I'd rather have investment in a character. So if that means a couple of games with the same setting-ish, generally speaking, in this, but the same protagonist, that'd, that'd, you know, be pretty damn cool. A lot of nature wants to kill me when there's a fucking abomination of science going on over there. 
The world wants me dead, but I'm still a gamer. God damn it! Do you like level system in AC games? I think the level system outstayed its welcome pretty quickly. Like leveling up, I mean, come on. I don't understand. I don't understand leveling curve, like locking areas and things like that. I guess um, Valhalla will sort of have a power sort of go for the power level thing, which is sort of what they did with Unity. Um, that's what we've heard, anyway. So I presume that it will be a bit, a bit more laid back, a bit less steep, maybe, and. You'll be able to just go through the game end to end without doing side content if you wish to, like the old Assassin's Creed games. And the rest will be there purely because it compels you to do so. And I think that's much stronger I think that's much stronger in world building in the world building sense than um, than forcing you into doing all these fetch quests that take hours and have lots and lots of uh, random damage sponge enemies. My point being, it's I reckon I reckon this is a good you move. You care nothing for our ancestors. You rape their tombs. Our history. Atamis would desecrate them without my help. At least this way I protect what I can. Protect? This is nothing but going to you. More drachma to lose on the roll of a dice. Priestess, I beg you, be prudent. Trust me. Justice will be served. These are not Pharaohs. They are our brothers. Fathers. Mothers. And trust me, our mothers will have retribution. It seems to be a habit of yours by arriving in the nick of time. That is what we like. Since when have you been working for tomb robbers, Tahamid? Our little altercation at the gambling den did not go unanswered. I had a choice. Prison? Or helping soldiers to catalogue the tombs. Ah, so you are the antiquarian med they spoke of. You have been researching the Ma'at ritual. Oh, that's gaming. Last breath, keep your voice down. Uh. If Atami's men here... Ah, oh, there's JMC. See? Them, Told you Jay, Jay would probably show up at some point. Walk with me. And please, try not to bring too much attention to yourself. Between the two bows and the sword and the hidden blade and the arm to the teeth look, including a beautiful shield, the I'll do my best. I haven't had a chance to review them all yet, but there are red-haired worshippers and all. Wait, could they be Ramasi's descendants? Ah, speaking of the great pharaoh, I have a fascinating papyrus that... Uh, perhaps I should see the ritual for myself. Go carefully. The door just the opened on there. Crawling with Atami's men. If you find the orb, I would love to see it. A relic passed down from the gods. May once in a lifetime find. Once? Huh. I wish it was so. May your blade be firm against your enemies by it. Oh god. Oh god, I think Eddie's just sent me a photo of two Nissan Dukes. Fuck's sake, Eddie. Oh god, he sent me he sent me just a photo of two Nissan Dukes parked outside his house. Yeah. And there we go. Let's let's go do some blood in the water gaming. Sorry, I had to respond to that tweet. You don't understand the great sadness it brings me whenever I see a Nissan Duke. <laughs> hey. Who is this man? I am not already dead, but I am. I'm pretty sure that that's half the point of the historical characters in Assassin's Creed. Boom <laughs> next. Nissan Jukes. Um, 
It's, it's a very, very hideous car. I think that's the, that's the nicest way to describe this Anjuke. It's a very ugly car. Um, the descendants that Tahimut spoke of. Where am I looking? Oh, okay. I guess in I guess in in the in the bumhole cave. Right, let's go. Go on in gamers. My hatred for Nissan Jukes has just distracted me. I'm really sorry. Hey, what? I am behind this table. You can't see me. What? I'm behind this table. You can't see me. Oh my god, he sped over here in rapid fashion. <laughs> he must have he must have cleared Usain Bolt speeds there. You're gonna die, son. Lovely. What car do you drive? Voxel Astra. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> it's not like I'm preaching from a position of power, but it is a lovely car. If you're from Europe, you'll know him as Opal. If you're from America, um, you may know one, one Astra model as a Saturn. But they don't really do. You know, they don't really do Opal um, cars in America. Amun, is this connected to the ritual? Tishy, do you know Joe? Um, jo Joe Mother, I guess, is what you're trying to get at. Because I actually do know a couple of Joes. So, God knows, man. That's just a decent cars. They are. They're, they're all rounders. They've got a bit of style. They've got a bit of zoom. Someone is they've got a lot of kick. For what they are. But they're very heavy. Very heavy. For especially for hatchback like style. You can get them in a state, and you used to be able to get them in saloon. Um, but for f the hatchback version, which is I've got the Astro J, um, so that's like a Mark Six. Um, very. You get my point. So, 1.5 times worth of hatchback, which is oddly heavy for a hatchback, I presume. People worshiping the relic. Priests of Ahenatan. Right, I bet two years from now, Ubisoft will reveal Assassin's Creed Primal. They better fucking not. What if there's a Joe Papa or a Joe Daddy? Well, that's... There's always a Joe Papa. The woman holds the relic aloft. The wife of the Aten. Nevertiti. This jet is now in Joe mode. Did it hold any <laughs> real power then? Oh no. Or was it just symbolic? He's that money car. The Cheers for the of super chat game. Forward. But the ritual... It is not to the goddess of truth, but dedicated to another god. Twin plumes of Amun. The ritual restores my art to everything under the sky. In honor of the Lord of Thebes. <laughs> Joe Bayek. Joe and the God's okay. wife at his side. The priests have the relic. Speaking about one of the Joes that I know, it's like for my tweets beginning. gaming. Ah, so she wasn't Isidora. angry that we're desecrating the gods. She brought down the Pharaoh's curse. Trying to justify it to me. Isidora's argument with Dahomet. Okay, what's this quest first? Unfair trade. Mother be buried here. Investigate the tomb of Isidora's mother. I best we... I imagine we should do this. It's good gaming. Merti left offerings here. To atone for what the tomb robbers did. Mother, my heart is broken and my bum hurts. Oh. Well, that's rather charming, I must say. Isidora's mother sits at the right hand of Amun, as the god's wife. Before Isidora do the Ramesses quest, don't worry, I will. Tomb murdered Nitocris when she tried to stop them ransacking the tombs. I don't plan on going for Isidora just yet. to bury her mother. The orb 
and her mother's legacy was passed to her. She vowed to revenge her, but she never had the means until now. Then years later, Merti came to try and make amends for what the others did. Especially I'm back, welcome back. The true I'm doing great, just some cheeky bit of camping. Ah, uh, camping. Mother, used to God do a lot vengeance. of it. I think, like, when, like growing up, I think it, um, it kind of sh shaped, uh, shaped my hatred on ca for camping quite a lot. But it just isn't something that I think I'd, I'd choose to do. Something I'd probably get along quite well at doing, but it's not something I'd enjoy. Ah, what's this? A child? Ah, their desecration is boundless. This strategist of Yebo must answer to Osiris. Unfair trade. Oh, we found a map. That's an odd name for a quest about a child who's been shot in the face. But okay, who, who am I to judge? Right. I can see that I'm gonna love this. Now, do you think Valhalla will have better side characters? I hope so. It's one of the biggest things that I'm, I'm kind of hoping for is superior side characters to perhaps some of the um, examples we've seen in recent years. Or, well, as much as I love Origins, I can't say that many of the side characters were particularly memorable. And Odyssey, what's a character? Was their approach. 111 people are watching. Well, if everyone could hit like, that'd be fantastic. I've been camping many times. Fucking hated it every time. I don't think... See? See, I don't hate doing camping, but I, I think it just... I think it was just overdone. Uh, for me, a little bit. So, I just... So, I just couldn't be asked anymore. I think um, camping for three weeks, when I was about 12, 13, camping for three weeks in the south of France um, was, well, it was dull at the best of times. Oh god, moved by it. And as much as I enjoyed it, I, like, you know, a bit of good weather, but it kind of ran stale. Most people went camping with a complete obstacle. Oh, I had some good times camping, I just don't think I'd... I just don't think I'd choose to go camping of my own volition now. If that makes perfect sense, I hope it would. What I'm trying to say is... Is not for me in that now. Steal Egypt's past no longer. I think it's fair to say that that quest is done. Steal Egypt's past no longer. There we go. Losers weepers. I guess we could do that. But where's the Ramesses quest? Is it King of Kings? Speak to Tahamet. Oh, that's the Ramesses quest. Right, let's go. Back these ends. I'm just gonna swim it, it's easier. Never experienced camping my whole life. Well, it can be pretty good, provided it's not overdone, but I just get bored incredibly easily. I also don't much enjoy being away from home, but it is what it is. Do you play Odyssey at all? I don't play Odyssey. I've played Odyssey through, including its DLCs, but I'll never touch the game again, if that's what you mean. Someone paid me a lot of money. 
Oh no, it seems kind of crap with better weapons to make you stronger as XP. Will be worthless. Nothing special, you go spend a few days out sleeping in a tent away from the comfort of time. I think that's kind of the charm to it in some aspects. I mean, as far as, get to, as, far as getting away goes, I mean, it's not the worst experience you'll ever have. I just think my, my problem with it is I got bored so easily. I have to always be doing something. And sometimes the whole point of camping is there's nothing to do, just sit and relax. And for me, that's... It doesn't fly, so especially not now. So I'll just go now. Nah, enjoy your camp. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna kip. No, <laughs> just stay. Because oh, I get bitten by mosquitoes. There's always that, but. Look at this. Tell me, what do you see? I see you, exactly where I left you, pouring over dusty papyrus and losing more than you win on dice. <laughs> Knowledge is not necessarily it's wisdom, been, by it. I've been camping in the north. You've heard of Ramesses the second, yes? The great Pharaoh, father to a hundred children. Uh huh. He is the Pharaoh. Who Dirt walks. bikes are better than camping, I think. How do you know? This speaks. They're not even the same, like strange. the same type of thing, though, are they? They're thousands <laughs> years old. When I when I camp, I don't relax. A great king. So what's the His fucking point? Fragmented. Just continue going to work. Say why he's here. Revenge? Oh, he has unfinished business. I'm always doing stuff. As do we all. Wait, Bayek. Let me see before you get yourself killed. Uh, Depends on what you're doing, I guess. Pharaoh's shadow. It's eight in the evening here and the sun is still high up. What time is it here? Six. All here. Fascinating. If he is like the others, I know what needs to be done. But I will need the parchment. Of course. So... About my finder's fee? Or you could give it to me from the goodness of your heart. <laughs> Unless you already lost that on another bad roll of the dice. Take it with my blessing. Ah. Ra protect you, Bayek. If you go to the stables in the village in the Valley of the Kings, you can buy the Afterlife Horse. Yeah, but this is New Game Plus and I already own it. So... Jib, his shout, his ren. Cool. What's this other quest do? Find the feet Ramesses shadow, but first we'll do this. This is how I will quieten the great Ramesses. Tell you what, we'll, actually we'll do that. We'll do the long one. Do all the Ramesses bits. They're important. It's just how it goes. Ten forty one PM here in India. I do not like Odyssey, I don't just dislike it, I despise it passionately, but please don't kill me. What time is it there, Fishy? I think I just said it's just gone six PM. Right, it's gaming time. How you doing, lad? Good old Fang showing up to show me that it's a gaming day. Imagine just one stream with no Odyssey talk. Impossible, even when I'm streaming something completely random. Well, I reckon when it comes to streaming the Horizon Zero Dawn DLC, I'll still be talking about fucking Odyssey. But it's fine. What country are you from? The United Kingdom. Uh, I used to think that my accent would give that away, but I understand that to um, non-native English speakers, it's never that simple. So, yeah, United Kingdom. <laughs> Like for example, I couldn't. I could. If you, if you, um, yeah. if, Soldiers if are you had two here. people spe speaking I French, one was from France, the other was from do. Canada, I wouldn't be able to tell them apart. But I'm sure a French person or a Canadian would. Eleven in Mexico, one AM in the Philippines. That's pretty gaming. It's inter it's fascinating to see where people are from. Got lots of members active in the ends. That's what we like. The 
dead lamented when unfading stars carried thee off. A prayer to the dead king. Find and get Queen Toya's canopic jar stopper. Now, what the fuck is a bat? <laughs> I'm from, uh, I, I don't, I think I'm gonna pronounce this horribly, but Skan in Sweden. It's pretty cool. 2239 in India, 109. Oh. I was. OH. What is OH? Uh, I presume that's somewhere in the United States. It's five hours behind. How can I be a Jedi Temple guard? Poo on the floor. Fishy is a gamer of all cultures. I do my best to be a gamer that. a gamer for everybody, but. you know. sometimes some people are just too. too damn positive. Uh. The scan have a unique dialect. Well, I don't. I don't know how. Like in the UK, accents are incredibly diverse. Like every different town has has its own sort of dialect going on at this point. Like um, everything is every square like twenty square miles or something. The accent noticeably changes in the UK, which is insane. Let me think about how many accents there are, and people just refer to like. Um, you can't wing a British accent, really, if you're going to go for an actual one. You can go for, like, the one that doesn't sound like much of one, but, like, you know, some, some, some accents don't. But they all have their own little quirks and things. It's quite, you know. It's quite fascinating how, how, how many accents you'll actually find in the UK. The further north you go... The more it sounds like you're in Game of Thrones, but if you go even further north, everyone becomes Scottish. It's actually not that far north, that northern accent that's quite hey, ugly to that is. I am in Thebes. The land of gamer. I think I brought this up a few episodes back. There will be a time where we will be recognised as ancient gamers. Isn't that mad? There will be a time where we're history as the ancient gamers. <laughs> and I think nothing brings me greater satisfaction than knowing that. I love it, I was like, that'll cost you, I will kill you, blah blah blah. No, you fucking won't, dickhead. This guy just swiped and took up half my health bar. You sound pretty Scottish. Who, me? Sound nothing like Scottish. Oh god. I know what Scottish sounds like, I don't... Nope. <laughs> not... Not even... Not even marginally do I sound Scottish. That's how un-Scottish I sound. I think of Joraptor. He makes some pretty cool content. If uh, if gaming news is what you're after, yeah, he, he makes some cool content for that. I don't really know him as a person, but I can respect the guy. You do not belong here, great one. Oh, for fuck's sake, Bayek! Well, now we're in a predicament, aren't we, lad? I think he's glitched. Not anymore is he glitched. Oh, he's still glitched. 
Why are you glitched? This is meant to be nightmare difficulty. You're meant to be a pain in the ass. The earth quakes. Take your place amongst the gods, Ramazis. Ramazis temple. Built so his memory would not wither. Keep the secret of his tomb. It is an it is an odd time, but it's fine. Yeah, Ethan's speaking with a Scottish accent for the rest of the stream. Fishy, do a Scottish accent. I don't, I don't know if I can. I genuinely don't know if I can. It is a difficult accent to do. I've got, I've got a mate who's Scottish named Brownie, and I feel like I'd insult him if, it, if I did a Scottish accent. But then again, also, I don't care if I do, because Brownie's an odd guy. He made, he makes fake Assassin's Creed leaks, like Assassin's Creed Adder. Anyone remember that? That was Brownie. Is that Brune? I was calling that instead of brownie because it sounds funny. I'll take the piss of it. That was indeed the best boss fight ever. Why? Because I had to literally do nothing but just scrap. He's vibing. <laughs> he was. <laughs> he was just vibing in Thebes, enjoying the scene. But no, we can't allow him to live. If anything. We've done bits against Ramesses there. Oh god, I remember AC Adder. Ah, uh, classic fake leak, that textbook. People fell for it. And you gotta respect that you gotta respect that Brownie made people fall for that shit hard. Um, because I could tell it was fake right away. Stomach. That your mates are now on fire and dead. Congratulations, dickface. Find and get a treasure map. Any treasure map? Don't worry, gamers, I got this. Oh, fuck. I don't have this. I'm gonna die. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Happens. I will just respawn somewhere more convenient for myself. That is what Assassin's Creed does when you've completed any objective. Isidora. She brought down the Pharaoh's If anything, it was actually quicker. To justify it to me. It, that death has convenienced me massively. 20 days still goes... Of Tsushima, let's go. Oh, I can't wait for Ghost of Tsushima. Uh, Tsushima. I keep saying the name wrong. Tsushima. Come on, get it right. Tsushima. Right, can't wait to play Ghost of Tsushima. I reckon it's going to be a cracking time, and I'm gonna have good, good, I'm gonna have good time with it. And we're gonna, we're gonna do some mad streams doing bits. I reckon. What's up, gamers? Typically the ceiling, but there are other things that are up as well, such as the sky and under normal circumstances, planes, but you don't see many of those these days. So, Ghost of Tsushima will be out relatively soon in the grand scheme of things, and I look forward to that. I reckon I'll do a stream like, like playthrough of it because I mean 
I think it'll be one of those games where I can just sit down and play for a couple of hours, then take a break and get back to it, and then take a break, and then so on and so forth, and that'll be my kind of time. Fishy, do you like memes? Uh, I, I like funny stuff, so if it's funny, yeah, I guess so. If it's not, then no, but I guess it depends on what the, the meme in question is. If it's a shit meme, it's not necessarily funny, but if it's a funny fucking meme. What will I find absolutely. in Ivaro's tomb? And what is the question? Watch my this is my favourite thing to do. Whee! Look at the light just move through the tunnels. It's very satisfying. Who dares into my tomb? Back of sea where oh it's just you. You fucking infidel. What are you saying for yourself? What path should I follow now? Oh no, off you go. Right, okay, Ethan, just having a psychic break, one of the many. But don't worry, after I'm done with this stream, I'll probably get cracking on some work on the Last of Us video. I want to get it up as soon as possible. <coughs> Ideally, I want to get it up tomorrow, but you know, things go how things go. But I reckon I've got plenty of time. It's Saturday, and nobody's going to be sleeping anytime soon, so I have a few hours to work on it. I'll get most of my thoughts out. It will be relatively raw because I feel like um, going too, too, what's the word, concise with it. I'll just wind up missing out what I want to say. But it will be edited, you know, to the point where it's still acceptable stuff. It will just be me, if anything, ironing out my own thoughts at the same time because it's going to be impossible to not do that way and this is the kind of game where in reviewing it you sort of have to iron out how you feel a bit as well and I'm quite happy to do that oh I like this I like this afterlife this is these bird things are stupid and stupid stop being man it's fine don't worry about it we're in Hebsed the game of land is it Heb Hebsed that's my that's my favorite name for a land ever Hang on a second, everybody. Gotta check something is all. It's fine, all good. Right, sorry about that. Just had to check something, but it's fine that it's all sorted. Uh, yeah, don't forget to leave a like on the stream, share with your friends, and subscribe if you're new. Look at this man. Ramesses the Great is your husband. In life, Didn't realize you had a fetish I for odd bird things. Most beloved consort, the favorite queen of a great man. Why does he walk the black land? He lived a glorious life, vanquished our enemies, gave us prosperity. But in death, his car finds no peace. Once, the Magi were servants of the Pharaohs. I am Magi no longer. But you know what it is to sacrifice for something greater than yourself. Ramesses served Egypt like no other. Has he not earned an ageless slumber? What will you have me do? I will whisper the ritual in your ear. Ah! Oh, ah, oh, fuck your box ticking exercise. Right, viewpoint. Who doesn't love a box ticking exercise in between? 
decent quests. Stallion of the Anubis. Can it even be ridden? Tamed. You know it can. We've been to different afterlives already. You are the cup bearer of the keeper. I come back and Ethan is talking to an owl with an Egyptian Set head. What lol? Of war Cheers to the super chat cigarette chair. The car <coughs> oh. of Have a little bit of a cough. Be furious in but don't worry, it's not the old Rona. Take it from those who hide it. If Atari is being a gamer. On the sands. Side by side, they must ascend into the deathless feathers and summon the bar, the traverser of worlds. The sky is overcast. The stars darken. Whatever any of that means, I do I guess I don't care just right now. I want the viewpoint. Increase Senu's perception in the afterlife because that makes sense. This afterlife is depressing, I guess. It's not even the do -up. I can climb on a man's gigantic ear. Let's do this. I am in the man's ear. I, I have the man's ear. It's gaming. Oh boy, we live. Yes, we are. For how long? Uh, best guess, another half an hour, probably. Ish. At least, I'd hope. Of uh, 35 minutes, That's probably a more accurate number. Sandstorm coming. It's fine. Look at all the dead horses. The face of the god is open. Reveal. That's why I had to put the fucking. Don't know why I had to hum Odyssey for no reason. Don't even enjoy it. Uh, but I do think it's funny. Oh god. Oh, the, the off thine must, like, fucking that. Right, okay. They're throwing things at me, naughty men. Dirty sirs. Which want a mouthful of sand, which everyone wants, trust me. I was wondering where the enemies had got to. It's fine, don't worry. Whatever. Isaac Sand, indeed. Of course, rough and irritating, and it gets everywhere. You are free. How am I on fire still? Stop being on fire. When I was young, I ate sand. War. Oh dear God! These are the bars oh, in it. Captive during Ramaz's battles. Merciful is he. Bam! Is Die. Free. Oh. Famine on two sides. Thou art become victorious and filled every atom with thy beauty. Encompass the heaven, the earth. All things in thine arms. Oh, 
I've nearly worked out, but it just didn't. And that's fine. I am a gamer. I'll figure it out. Oh, fuck's sake. When they move... I like how he's like, hey, who are you? Well, they've just edited the voices of the regular enemies. <laughs> or something. To make them sound a bit more demonic and dead. Now I must have skinned into the heavens. The Pharaoh's hem set. It's all done. Now what other quests do we have? Finally collect the Pharaoh's car. Must not get lost. Alright, where, where are you at, gamer? Let's go. My opinion, people who say tailing and eavesdrop missions should come back are idiots. I uh, know, I quite like eavesdropping. I was never too big on tailing, but a little bit wouldn't go in here. So, I mean, not all of the game, but maybe the on, like, you know, a couple of missions in a game you could follow someone, I guess. It's not bad. It's when it's overdone, any mission becomes boring. Like, rescue missions in Origins are fucking insane. The amount of, you know, go here, rescue this person, carry them out of a place. And then once you do, they stand up as if they've never had... They're, they're, there's no reason to carry them, besides when they wanted to be carried by the big old it. My point is, anything that's done to excess, like tailing missions were, or rescue missions are, um, in Origins, you know, they become tiring for that purpose, but they don't necessarily... I mean, you know, have to be gone completely. I presume that golden thing is where I'll be going. I was never too keen on tailing missions, but Elect of Rath, Assassin's Creed. His servant bears down upon you, carries his yoke. Keen your blade, Capera. Oh, fuck's sake, game. There we go, that was awkward as shit, but we're out. Slow mo, please. The chat's not going that fast. Well, Cyberpunk had an animus. That's not quite what it was, but it, I guess if you want to avoid being specific. Chat's getting out of control today. I've seen this chat out of control. What it is today is far from it. Nobody's even spamming. <laughs> exactly. If anything, this is the most chill my chat's been for at least two months. Well, probably more accurately since I streamed that um, that that C game a couple of days ago and had a chill time.
revealing him upon his family. I'm fastest now. Cerulean, the turquoise as stars, the dust veil lifted from his eyes. Right now. It's time to game. <laughs> I can't decide whether I should replay the Mass Effect trilogy or an older AC game. I'd choose Mass Effect, but that's very time consuming. Yeah, but Mass Effect is always worth it. I love Mass Effect. It's great. Mass Effect 1, 2, and 3. Can't beat them. They just appear out of nowhere, those guys. Ah, here we are at the at the head of gaming. This battlefield. Is like more Adewale or Elise? God knows, man. I don't I don't think about. I've never thought about which one do I prefer out of Adewale and Elise. I guess Adewale. He's a cool guy. Bringer of peace, champion of Kadesh. Face me. I bring you rest. I'm playing the Fallout 4 again. That doesn't sound like a bad show. Hope you enjoy. This game is way too long. I'm 70 hours in and I still have a long way to go. It's not too bad. I've played some long games. This one's not too bad. Origins is much more atmospheric than Odyssey. It sure is. By the way, this man is going to die. Now he's not standing around to... Oh, God. As if... He just one-hit me. Oh, my days. He just one-hit me. Wow. Isidora. She brought down the Pharaoh's curse. Tried to justify it to me. Try again. I guess Ramesses is the hardest. He's giving chase. I wish I could summon foggy like bits. I mean, smoke bombs, I doubt they're going to work against the fucking god life, but whatever. I can't see shit. I just want you to know this. No Ramesses, dip. Who doesn't like gaming? I'm better. He's chasing me, but he's faster than me. I'm very confused and frightened by this man. Ramesses is a scary boy. Once you know his patterns, I guess it's not too rough. 
just gotta not fuck up. With the fog, you bastard. Okay. At least once he's done it, it'll be the last time he throws fog on me. I'm well aware that he can one-hit me. Oh, for fuck's sake, Bayek. Oh, he's evolved. He can do a bit, he can be a bit rougher now. Stop chasing me, you goon. There we go. Whew. Ra grant you eternity with your beloved by. Ramesses was a big sir. Such greatness. But did he achieve this alone? Is that, oh, that is a turn. Okay. That was hard work. I mean, he could one hit me at any point. I was practically pulling myself. But we did okay. We did everything we could. Now, is there a quest that I could bring here? No, there's no quest here. I'm sure there is a quest we can find here, right? I'm sure there is one. Yes, there is. Follower or leader. Let's go do that. There we go. The horse thing. Ramesses is dead. Again. <laughs> a classic one for Ramesses, unfortunately. Cheers to the super chat, Isak. I really do appreciate it, man. Do I randomly just get gifted arrows as I go? Oh yeah, I guess I do. Did I get Origins or Odyssey? I'd go for Origins of the two. <laughs> That's it. How can I hope to best those beasts? Father can command all he wants, but I am no warrior. Your father has you hunting scorpions, boy. Boy? Another come to patronize me? Forgive me. I am tired of trying to make him understand. Him in his damn trials. I do not want to walk his path, Neb. Bayek, 
You wish to he said his name yourself. randomly again. Hmm. Tell me of this ceremony you risk your life for. He thinks it will make me a man. Accept my responsibilities. Recover the symbols. Strength, protection, power. <laughs> Folklore and fallacies. But you do not want to defy him. Even if that means oblivion. Perhaps I could be your champion. And what would that make me? A coward? <laughs> A failure? Ah, smart. Such trials are not the only thing that make a man. I will teach my son this. By Ra's light, you are right, Bayek. I will wait for you north of here. I mean, that, that hair colour, if anything, gives away that it's Ramesses' son. And that he's a gamer and that, innit? Okay. Collect golden scorpion's blood. I'd love to. Oh, the, the scorpion is actually a bit golden. Bring the blood to Setna. Where is Setna now? He's, he's mooched. Good old Setna mooching. Or has he mooched? I think he has mooched a little bit. You did it? You got the blood? Was it terrifying? Pitted against a fearsome foe, not knowing if you would live or die? Hey, you have a way with words. Do you think? My dearest wish is to be a scribe. Well, unfortunately, pal, you are m dead, so... A mighty warrior? It would shame him to have a writer for an heir. No, he will want his legacy to be a good son. What is our next trial? The symbol of protection. We must steal an onk from the caverns of the Valiant. Can it be desecration in the realm of the dead? I will return to you when I have it. For the final trial, come find me at the end to the caverns. Okay, let's go. Find and get the unk. Okay, we'll do that, that's fine. Don't worry about it. Where's that bloody horse? Let's get the likes to 150, I think that'll be a good number. Remember, if you're new, to smash the subscribe button and be an absolute gamer, sir. Because gaming is what we like. It is what we do. Bayek is not an ancestor to Desmond. As far as we can, as far as we know. That shit. What's this? Dedication from Ramesses. Oh, I guess that's cool. None of this is really real. Bring the Yonka to Setna. I'd love to. <laughs> Go. Oh, this, be this guy better not hide. Oh, for fuck's sake, man. I rate the intelligence, but also fuck off and die. Bam. I'm such a cool gamer. Everyone agrees. The Even my mum is to show him a tenet of manhood. Protect those in your care. Such a small thing? Was it very hard to get? Did the spirits of the fallen scream and shriek? 
wrap their icy fingers around your throat? <laughs> hey, you have a vivid imagination. It is both a blessing and a curse. Mm. I can imagine. What happens when the trials are done? I I'm currently exporting a video from my YouTube channel while watching this, and I wanted to say that you're one of my biggest inspiration. Thank you, you so much. You will hear me? That's cool. Stand I, hope, I hope your video got, does well, man. He will hear you. The last trial is to take the Pharaoh's pastiche from the Great Sand Sea. It will be spewed forth from the desert. The symbol of power is the beard. A boy is a boy no longer with hair on his chin. Ah, see. I will That's meet where you I went, the right. I have a bit of hefty beard going on right now. The horse just ran headfirst into that rock. What a fucking idiot. Get touring about, doesn't he? This Setna character. They say a man's strength lies in his beard, and yet I let Aya shave mine off. Did you fuck? <laughs> Are you telling me that in all these years, Bayek's beard never grew back? Canonically speaking, because that makes no sense whatsoever. But okay. What will Sipna's father do with such a trinket? Poo on the floor and shit on Grandad. My gamer. Great Ramesses, keeper of harmony and balance. My father, your trials are completed. Your will done. follow you. My path is my own to walk. Then go with Ra, my son. Is that just Abu Bakar Salim? <laughs> Again. You are not the lion leading an army of sheep. Oh, lion. it's because his voice... Oh, that makes sense now. But their destinies are yeah, forged. I've only played through the CLC once before. I don't remember much, evidently. Let that bring you peace. <laughs> ah. It was just Bayek's voice. He was Ramesses. Absolutely loving it. Much sorrow. That's a that's a decent shield to be fair. It's not quite as good as this one, which you get from the trials of the gods and that. But whatever. There's nothing else to do in these lands besides some box ticking exercises that nobody gives a fuck about. So off we trot. Now we must. Uh, what we must do is we must continue with the curse of the pharaohs and assassinate Dickface. So Bayek's, wait, so that was Bayek's son? No, it was not Bayek's son, it was Ramesses' son. 
Um, but it was Bayek's voice to, um, because then Ramesse somehow morphs into Bayek to send him like a message sort of thing. I don't know what it is. It's all, it's all piece of Eden trickery, um, basically. Simplest way to describe it. Let's get to 150 likes. We're really close. We can do that. That'd be really cool. And also, if you haven't shared the stream with all your mates, that'd be fantastic and appreciated. Provided they like Assassin's Creed, otherwise, yeah, uh, that'd be great gaming. I must be careful now. Imagine not liking the stream. Yeah, imagine forgetting to like the stream. It must be done. I'm sure there are four people here who are yet to like, and if they like, then we'll be in, then we'll be in God territory. <laughs> Stop missing the haystacks, Bayek! I love... I love how even when I aim for the haystacks, sometimes Bayek will miss. Isidora. She brought down the Pharaoh's curse. Tried to justify it to me. There we go, we got 150 likes. Everything else is just bonus points at this point. Uh, they will attack on sight here. Let's try again. <laughs> Kills a god, immediately dies to a fall. Well, buy a cup of seaware, everybody, uh, ladies and gentlemen. The relic corrupts absolutely. Isidora cannot believe this is the will of the gods. Priestess has summoned the army of Anubis to protect her. Bam! Stab. It's an illusion. Because of course it is. <sighs> Curse of the illusions. The relic. It is twisting what I see. I must find her. Hate it when it does that. Reaches Hitora's quarters. Isadora the Explorer. Okay. <laughs> Don't know why I said that, but y you know what? Whatever. It worked. Investigate is Hedora's quarters. Locked. Whatever her reasons for doing this, they must be behind this door. Let me guess, there's just a convenient window though, so it's fine. <laughs> As the wife of the Hidden One, she would keep her secrets close. Story in my at What's this? Oh, a false. Ah, rip. Be gone. Is it she all the letters? Could kill countless in a misguided quest for. Whatever. What's this? Sorry, a hidden play. tomb in the Valley of the Kings. The thieves never found it. She always had the relic. Is that an onion? What is what? Uh, I don't know if that is an onion. I don't know. I don't care. Text on the Ma'at ritual by Nitocris. God's wife of Amun. Could this be Isadora's mother? Ah, oh, cheese. She means to finish what her mother started. A ritual to restore Ma'at in the hidden tomb of the long-forgotten pharaoh. <laughs> What's 
alternative incoming. Okay. I guess this is this is our chance to go to Gamerville. Let's fast travel to the viewpoint and go from there. Looks like a pomegranate. Oh, okay. Pomegranate. I prefer to think it's an onion, thank you very much. But if it is not an onion, that is what it is not. I wish I was in Gamerland, don't you worry. One day Gamerland will be a thing where they will celebrate the ancient gamers. The, the ancient gamers. One day we will be ancient gamers, for we are... Technically... The, 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 technically in the early years of gaming, and this, at least when it comes to how people will look at it in like 200, 300 years time, and then in a thousand of years time, maybe everyone will still be gaming, and if they are, then we are technically the ancientest of gamers. What will it take for you to play Odyssey? Um, a lot of fucking money, in short. And honestly, I just don't... I think I'd not do it on principle. So please don't get any ideas. Maybe it's pomegranate shaped cheese. How much money? No, let's not go there. Let's, let's not do this. I know what it is like to lose someone you love. But this orb corrupts everything it touches. Common prey now. Bayek. Give me the orb. I do not want to kill you. My mother is like Assassin's Creed. Is our bad as she. <laughs> Cheers to the super my at and put Amun back on his throne. This the lighting coming off of this apple born. is fucking intense. This is why to hide and watch as they slit your throat. So I would have the strength to do Amun's will. This is not strength. This is savagery. Here we are in Gamerland. Come and uh, at, at a club's foot, didn't he? So he's walking a bit too normally for my taste. It was it was a it was a deformed man was top face. I think I hope that Ramesses was the hardest anyway, because that was a it wasn't hard per se, but I didn't want to get hit. If I could help it, you know. Yeah. 
Don't do anything stupid. Allow me to just defeat you nicely, top face. I imagine that people refer to him as top because nobody looks at this guy without feeling somewhat disappointed. I don't know what he does when he does his magical voodoo shit, but whatever it is, shite ones. There we go, done. King Tick. I agree, Eta. Cheers again. I subbed an absolute sir in the making right there. Here he is, as a big sir. His father, Achenaten, passed down the orb. Tutankhamun wanted to restore balance. Trusted it to the priests of Amun. But Isidora distorted the ritual in the name of vengeance. She betrayed her own gods. The Ren will guide the way out of the Duat. Okay. It's abscond from the Duat. What's up, Lord Fishy? I'm here for you. Hello there, Nicole. How you doing? I guess I'm following the Ren. Because why wouldn't you follow the Ren? Dog's yapping. Having a yap. Loving it. Honestly, it was actually upstairs today. Right, we, go. Oh, yeah. we don't usually let him up. But I, like, I opened my door and he was just chilling there. So I suppose I presume somebody let him up. And that's fine. Really? I'm currently in the middle of battling some blokes, so if the Ren could like be very patient, I have many appreciations for this Ren. It's taking me on a very scenic route. Dog's really yapping, he's really going for it. I think he's I think he's found something that he wants to bark at. 
which happens very often with that dog. He loves it. That was a good yap. Can't have done it now, fishy. Bloody Isadora the Explorer. How far back are you? Yeah, Isadora the Explorer. Oh god. If these lads actually paid attention, I'm on my way out. But not to worry, we are actually absconding now. It's fine. Cutscene ones. I won't chose you. I do not understand. This was my birthright. My revenge. Why did he hear my cry? Why did he give me the power to finish what she started? Only for me to fail. Daniel Sevilla Jr., Chief of the Super Chat, big sir. You're you absolutely gave your choice. I really do appreciate it. Man. Did Father have my hat? No! My heart is too heavy. Do you believe Amun will protect me? As easy as it is to do wrong, it is easy for Amun to be merciful. His wrath passes any moment. Oh, I know why Dennis was barking. It has been taken for a walk. His wrath comes back in mercy. I wonder how much money Fishy makes. May the hidden one walk with you. Eh. I think the best answer the I can give to that Duat is enough to ensure that I make cracking content for you guys. We have the orb. Soundtrack is fantastic. Put me down. Put me down. Uh, I think I can manage on my own. Can you? Uh, I once thought I had no one left in the world. Now I am a descendant of Ramesses the Great. And I have a family bigger than I could have imagined. Small price to pay. Thank you, Nep. What will you do now with that horror? By Ra's light, I do not want it. All the more reason you should take it. You better than anyone knows what it can do. Bury it. And all memory of it. All right, but not here. There are no secrets left in this valley. Ah, there must be one more, Sen. You restore Ma'at, then leave? If that is what you want, then no one will hear of you from me. Hey, Bayek. We will meet again in the field of reeds. I will see to it. That is all right. We do not need any help. We will close all of this up in a moment. <sighs> and that's the DLC quest done. Now I've got two ability points from that. So what we're going to do is we're going to invest them into Hunter, I think. Now. That's the DLC done, but there is one last thing that we need to do, so... 
this is the bit that this is the bit that sets up a sequel that never happens. If you get me, like it's quite obvious that they they could have taken Bayek's story somewhere with this, but they chose not to, and I think it's pretty cool. Let's go into the Waset Desert. I don't know which one it is, but we'll just go in the general direction and we'll find it. It's fine. Like if you've not played the DLC before, then this this is the this will this will creep you out a little bit. But it's uh, it's kind of like a setup thing. I think it's pretty cool. But I feel like this is the true end that they want you to discover on your own, um, as opposed to just you know, that's it. That's all done. That's why I always thought you get a sequel. Me too. Because I felt like they were deliberately setting it up with this, but apparently not. But it's fine. We'll go do it. It'll be, it'll be alright. Did you play the hidden ones? The hidden ones is all played and done, yeah. House of the Blue Lotus. Don't worry. That is my gaming name. House of the Blue Bollocks. Level 55, since when is that possible? If you um, play, if you have the DLCs, then that's the level cap. So we made a sequel to Bayek set in the prime of the Roman Empire. You see, the Roman Empire didn't even exist when Bayek was alive. It was the Republic, and it only became the Empire, the Roman Empire. I think a few, I think a few decades still after this. I think people need to understand that the Roman Empire was a little bit more recent than they think. That the Roman Empire is much more AD than a. Uh, well, yeah, much more common era than, than BCE, uh, for example. Like Caesar wasn't emperor; he was. Just, he was. Yeah, I think he tried to be, but it was still the Republic at that time. Oh, uh, there. One question: Is it worth playing New Game Plus after all the quests are done? I mean, if you want. Oh, for fuck's sake, Bayek! If you want to. I mean, there's not, not wrong with it. Well, there's a viewpoint back there. Let's double back and get that before we go anywhere. Otherwise, it'll be a disaster. Doesn't Caesar literally mean... Caesar was never Emperor of Rome. The first emperor of Rome was his uh, nephew slash adopted son, Augustus, technically, or as he was known before, he was Augustus Octavian. Um, I think that's right. I don't know. My history, my history, my ancient history is not the best ever, but I think that's roughly the gist of it. And he became the first Roman Empire. So in theory, the rise of the rise of the Roman Empire was around this time, or the the switch. Anyway, Rome had already risen, but it wasn't an empire yet. If that makes sense. This is where we need to go. There. Yeah, that's right. See? I have got some part of brain. Augustus is a cool name. I guess so. Camelot Assassin's Brotherhood. But Ca Camelot never existed <laughs> as far as we're aware Fishy, would you ever do a ranking of the modern days of AC yeah, that wouldn't, wouldn't that be cool to be fair I expect to see some Arthurian easter eggs in uh, Assassin's Creed Valhalla that's here this is the place it's not that other place it's here look at all the snakes Ron Osborne cheers for the super chat man I really do appreciate you absolute legendary sir why does nature hate me? Just 
Shoot the fucking hyena, man. Oh, he's fucked. Sutek. No sign of any injuries, to be fair, though. Besides from maybe the pool of blood, that it might be. I don't think he is even in the pool of blood. But that's that's the that's the you know the cool little end to the DLC that makes you think, ooh, they could be setting up a sequel, but nah. Are oh, they fuck? There you go, that's the Curse of the Pharaohs expansion. Thus concluding this um this like run through of Assassin's Creed Origins altogether. Which is madness. We've actually gone and done it. We've gone through Well I started I did it I did an Ezio trilogy playthrough, like the the, collect, the Ezio collection. And no we get it, we, we get it. Sutek Sutek dead in that, it's fine. Uh, we, and then we went from there. I didn't do Assassin's Creed one, uh, because it's just not reliable on PC and I can't get access to a console that can you know, play it like the Xbox 360, for example, that's in the attic and I can't be asked getting out and all that. Um, and also it's probably fucked by now and all that stuff. Uh, my point being, we've gone through more or less all but one of the Assassin's Creed games. Didn't do Liberation, because fuck that. I didn't do Odyssey, because fuck that. And But beyond that, it's all good. Didn't do the Chronicle ga Chronicles games, because also, I must stress, fuck that. Um, but we did okay. It's been a chill little series. It's taken us the best. It's taken us practically three months, hasn't it? Uh, the entirety of lockdown. I'm just chilling with my dead hyena. Leave me be. Yeah, that's right. Keep on trotting, your camel faces. Um. So yeah, no. I think this concludes our stream for today. Because I don't know where else I'm going to go from here. I think it's all done. <laughs> practically. Do Red Dead Redemption 2 next. I mean, I would do, but. Oh my god, there's a fucking hyena attacking me again. Bloody, bloody bastard hyena, we're gonna die. Nobody fucks with me, not even the hyenas. Now, oh yeah, it's one of those gaming moments. Will it be Assassin's Creed based in Ryan Master, Assassin's Creed Valhalla? I don't know. But no, it's been a fun stream series playing through all these games. Um, yeah, uh, but I think that concludes this stream. 81 Remake, please, I'd love a remake. Assassin's Creed 1, but I'd also love a good Assassin's Creed game in a unique, fresh setting. I'm hoping Valhalla is that, but God knows. But yeah, thank you all for watching the series. I hope you enjoyed. Be sure to go ahead um, stream the Undisputed Best Assassin's Creed Rebellion. Be sure to go ahead, leave a like, subscribe, share the channel with your friends and all that wonderful stuff. That would be fantastic. Um, I'd like to thank all our super chatters, Cigarette Chair, James Rostron, Isaac Marnie, uh, Daniel Sevilla Jr. and Ron Osborne for your, you know, donations this stream has been fantastic. I really do appreciate it. And also, a thank you to all the lovely patrons. There's a link in the description. You're going to go ahead and check it out for yourself. For yourself. Um, whether or not you think it's worth it is completely up to you, of course. But there is a little bit of extra bits and pieces going on over there if you so wish to take it. But, you know, in the end of the day, that is completely up to you. Don't feel forced to do that. Um, if you can't, don't want to, or aren't sure, then please don't. It's absolutely fine. I'm in no position to not understand. I absolutely do. It's, it's fantastic. Um, but yeah, check out the community Discord. Um, the link in the description if you want to keep a good chat. And I'm sure I'll be back very soon streaming something else, just not necessarily Assassin's Creed. So, I'll see you all very soon with uh, another video or stream at some point. But until then, take care and goodbye.